on guys I am going to do my best to try to explain a theory I have on well let's just cut to the chase I'm going to call it the matrix and yes I got that name uh, from the movie great movie I see a lot of youtubers who give opinion videos on stuff that's going on in the world and uh, in fact I just watched one and the guy said every single day he's getting inundated with news about inflation and supply chain shortages and, and it's just getting worse and worse and worse and although there is some truth to what he is saying we need to realize that we are a, are a victim of our own matrix and let me explain what the matrix matrix is the matrix is everything that we experience and that we expose ourselves to so if you get on YouTube and you watch videos video after video after video about how bad things are and how bad things are gonna get guess what YouTube is gonna provide you anytime you get on YouTube you guessed it you're going to get that type of content because they want you to continue to watch. So if you keep watching it, they're going to keep giving that to you. And that doesn't mean that the content is untruthful. It doesn't mean that it's dishonest. It doesn't mean that what you're thinking is not correct. But understand what's happening. If you get on YouTube or Rumble or any of these other places, I don't know about Rumble, but... If you get on the internet and you search for flat earth things, and you're constantly looking at flat earth, you're on YouTube, you're constantly looking flat earth, flat earth, flat earth. Why is the earth proven to be flat? Blah, 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 blah. Guess what's going to happen the next time you get on YouTube? There's going to be a bunch of flat earth videos on there. So need to understand, and by the way, this happens with everything. If you get on there and, and you constantly search, uh, Trump is evil, Trump is evil, you're going to get more and more Trump is evil content, and vice versa. By the way, Trump's not evil. But, it's important that we all understand that this does, in fact, take place. Because we need to have a realistic perspective and uh, our vision needs to be clear with the truth. Because there is a truth out there. So I have told several people recently that whatever the um, subject matter might, might be, there's an opinion spectrum from way to the left, and I don't necessarily mean political left, but it could be, but way to the left, you've got extreme views on whatever that topic is, and way on the right, you have extreme views on that topic. I mean, these are fringe opinions and views. Doesn't mean they're wrong, but what I have found is in a high percentile of cases, uh, there is definitely some, uh, there's a lack of uh, accuracy. So you have extreme left, extreme right, and where we need to be is right in the middle of reality, which is truth. And again, I'm not talking necessarily political perspectives when I say left and right. I'm just talking about whatever the subject matter is. And I continue to see people that will be way on one side of an issue. And they're constantly sharing, they're watching, they're reading, they're listening to only that side of a particular topic. And then I on the on the right side, I see the same thing. And their opinion is being developed by 
of that which they believe is facts when in fact it's biased propaganda. Not that there's not some truth in there or some facts, but that the way that it is spun and the way it's presented is biased propaganda. So our matrix affects our opinion. And you may be going, duh, but once I realized that how this was happening, I began to really question some of the information that I was getting. And I feel now that uh, opinions that I develop are based much more squarely on facts, logic, and common sense rather than hyperbole and conjecture and alarmism and extremism and whatever other isms you'd like to throw in there. So, let me know what your, th what your thoughts are. Um, I appreciate you watching. Please share. Please comment below. Smash that like button and subscribe if you haven't. We'll catch you later. Stay safe.